<clears throat> Hello ladies and gents, my name is Pat, and welcome back to the regalia. Uh, the following footage is obviously not a gameplay. Um, I'm sorry that a video was not up for the past two days. Uh, I knew the holidays were just simply too good for me. In my parents' home, we discovered that the attic was poorly done, and this happened. Let me, let me show you guys the footage I recorded when I went up there. There you go. Yeah. Now, at this time of the year in Canada, the temperature drops to about negative 20 to 30 degrees Celsius. That's without wind, okay? Now, wind chill comes in. Mmm, baby. This is pretty normal, though. This is pretty normal. However, um, what's happening in the attic space is not normal. If you aren't familiar with what an attic is, the attic is the space between the ceiling of your actual house and the roofing. Now, this space should be as cold as outside. So this doesn't happen. There's supposed to be about uh, 12 to 18 vents, okay? These things called baffles. I didn't even know these things. I had to Google them. So there's about 12 to 18 of these things. Uh, however, our house only had three of these installed. So there's my dad right there. And yeah, we went up here. We tried to do our best. I don't know, man. It's, it's a pretty big project and it, it, it's so small. You could fit a crouching person in here, but the workspace, you have to crawl. So the frost built up, so let's go over there. There you go, that's a perfect one. The frost built up in there and when the sun was at its highest, so about noon, it would melt the frost. Yep, so it would drip, right? It would drip down. Our roofing is fine, so we're not even worried about the shingles. Gas inside the attic space froze and it would be over there. So the sun would melt this. Water started to drip down and ruin our insulation and go through our ceiling like our second floor ceiling. So in some areas, it was drenched. And in areas we didn't touch a lot, like in the backs of our closet, like uh, we stored boxes in there, mold started to grow. So yeah, we're taking care of this problem. Enough of this. Uh, let's go back to some Persona 3, guys. Thank God, not my, my closet wasn't touched. I'm really thankful, but... Uh, some areas was pretty affected. Sorry about the the grim, the grim story. I guess of my holiday. Um, I went and leveled up my friends. I got lots of personas. I cleaned up my rosters. Uh, I got uh, lots of personas. I think what I did was I wanted to try like a specific persona for like an element. So fire, ice, lightning, wind, dark, and light. And then like the physical ones. Morning. Hey, Padkin. I wonder why Shinjiro Senpai came back so suddenly. Uh, I don't know. That's true. It's kind of scary if you ask me. But it doesn't seem like he's rejoining seas because he likes to fight. Yeah. Um, I'm not sure if I'm doing the right thing with the personas or whatever, but I think it's pretty good because it helped me fight. Oh, are we having a test? All right. Hello, class. Bagahi Alaka Bachabe. Are you ready? Then let's begin. Today, we'll discuss the magic of the Renaissance. The Renaissance was a time when the arts and sciences enjoyed a resurgence in Europe. Naturally, this had a profound influence on magic. It might be more accurate to say the two studies helped improve one another as to why the Renaissance helped to further magic. They, they had found a way to escape the rule of the church. By studying the teachings of previously forbidden sects, uh, the knowledge of magic spread. Uh, the Renaissance also brought about the revival of ancient Greek and Roman literature. Magical texts such as the uh, Hermetica received new translations and study philosophy, natural history, alchemy, astrology, I'm pretty sure even art. The book was filled with a wide range of subjects and could be called the Bible of magic. Just as science and astronomy have made strides in modern day, so too has the art of magic. You can see this in the emergence of a great magician who applied the knowledge of the Renaissance. John Dee was a professor who advised the Queen of England, but with the magical knowledge he obtained, he was able to talk to angels. Then, there was Hohenheim, a doctor who traveled across Europe. Uh, he became known as Paracelsus, a renowned uh, physician and alchemist. Of course, a magician's life wasn't an easy one. Both men lived lives riddled with persecution. Are you all listening? Keep your minds down to earth. 
Here's a test to see if you are paying attention. Get it wrong and your house will become irre irrevocably haunted. Now who should be my victim? Pat, I ask thee. There was a lot of information to read there. Oh my god. Uh, the Hermetica. The Book of Thought is... Uh, like... Fate. What do you call that again? Uh, tarot. Tarot cards. Uh, Hermetica. Alright. Back to your peaceful life. Magic at the time had a great influence on the church ruled society. Several magicians were involved with the central part of the Renaissance, the religious revolution. He gave the correct answer. Alright, our charm increased, but I'm not even worried because we maxed our charm. Friday, Friday, Friday. Uh, Hidetoshi. Hide san. I'll call him Hide. Hide san. Oh, Fuka's there. I can see her legs. Is he actually? Does he actually want to talk about the smoking incident? Uh, the other day, I was talking about the cigarette butt in the boys' bathroom. The teachers want uh, the student to be expelled as soon as I find out who it is. Oh, expelled immediately? Hmm. Expulsion, huh? Hide San looks exhausted. So Patkin, what do you think? About the smoker's punishment, that is. Uh, the usual will do, he should suffer. I don't know. This guy, he sounds like he guides with an iron fist. He should suffer. Uh, he should suffer. I think so too. Oh man, Hidesan seems torn. I think once I catch the culprit, I'll give him a good lecture. After all, the point is to try and prevent it from happening again. It'd be great if I could get people like him to change their ways. I don't sympathize with students who break the rules, but... Will kicking the bad kids out really make school a better place? I don't know why I'm complaining, it's really not like me. I guess I'm just confused because I feel so powerless. I'll have more power if I do what the teacher wants and win his trust. Then people will have to listen to me. Watch me, Pat Kuhn. I'll work my way to the top. Hidesan open to us. You know what, guys? I, I disagree with that idea because I think you could gain power through respect. If you respect people, they should respect you back. Alright. Emperor Arcana. Alright, level 7. This is such a high, uh, high social link for me, too. I thought it would be like level 5. Oh, I get to draw. Let's go. Whoosh. Emperor Arcana, level 7. Level 7. I have some work to do. I'm going to make a list of suspects. What if it was a girl? She just threw, threw the cigarette butt in the male's washroom. You should go home, Padkin, and be careful. Uh, oh, okay. It's about the food again. I I, I tried, but I, I don't make the food choices. I don't make the food choices, Koromaru. I'm sorry. <laughs> Shinjiro, what are you doing? Uh, and strength and endurance both increases fast. Its skills and agility aren't bad either. Caster doesn't have any weaknesses. Well, I guess its luck isn't that great, but that doesn't matter in battle. But you gotta depend on luck. Then you're oh, but oh, if you gotta depend on luck, then you're good as dead. You're as good as dead. You're right. Uh, okay, let's go to speak to that man outside. Oh, there you are. We ran into a bit of a snag again. Some of the other investors decided to drop out. Since there are fewer investors, each person's profits will be even bigger. Do you mind investing a bit more? Hoo-wee! I'm just throwing money at this guy. Uh, okay. Sure, let's go. You give the man 10,000 yen. My foolish little apprentice. Have you not realized that you are being deceived? Everything I've said has clearly been suspicious. Ah. I knew that from the start. Ignorance should be a crime. Sure, you have some positive equalities, but if you remain so naive, everyone will take advantage of you. Stick with me, and I'll show you how to be a winner. Did we win games, or...? 
Very well, young man. If you insist, I'll give you my autograph. It's always a pleasure to meet a fan. Uh, who are you? Don't you have a television? Are you living in the Stone Ages? How barbaric. I'm sure you've seen the- Oh, yeah, Tanaka! Allow me to introduce myself. Yeah, yeah. I can't believe this, man. I've read- I read a comment too. I've read- the, uh, I've seen his show. I can't believe this, man. President and executive producer Tanaka. That's right, I'm Tanaka. Surely you've heard the name. I'm afraid I cannot return the 40,000 yen you gave me, but I've autographed my business card for you. Hold on to that. Uh, it'll be worth a pretty penny. Toodaloo. All right, old man. If you get beat up in the middle of the road, I'm not. I'm not helping you out. Uh, he turned and walked away. His fake smile melted into a look of annoyance. Of course. That little brat. Doesn't he realize he's in the presence of a star? I don't give a crap. I should have charged him extra for a private autograph signing. You can hear talking to. You can hear him talking to himself. Uh, say something to him. I can hear you, man. Huh? What do you want? Quit disturbing me. Shoo, shoo. Uh, d did you he overhear me talking to myself? You'll forget it ever happened if you know what's good for you. I belong to a powerful talent agency. I'm practically a celebrity. I have an image to maintain. Don't even think about telling someone he took my money or he called me a little brat. Capiche? Uh, quish? <laughs> Quiche? Quiche? Oh, very funny. You may be cute, but you're no comedian. Ah, uh, his forehead is beating with sweat. Ah, uh, silly me. I've let you in on my secret, haven't I? Don't tell anyone, okay? Please, I'll lick your shoes clean if you want me to. Ah, uh, alright. Seriously, you promise? I'll make you swallow a thousand needles if you're lying. I'll make sure you take a thousand bullets. From Igis, she, uh, she can kill on command. She can kill on command. A verbal agreement is considered a contract, and I'll sue your pants off if you breach ours. I've got your adorable little face etched into my memory. Uh, he seems to have taken an interest on you. Uh, you become acquainted with Tanaka, uh, the executive producer of a TV shopping program. All right. Thou shalt have our blessing when thou choosest. Oh yeah! Oh, Devil Arcana! Woo! All right, all right, all right. Okay, we got this. <laughs> Level one, Devil Arcana. I usually take my breaks here. I'd be happy to mold your young mind whenever you wish. Every day you take a break here. After saying goodbye to President Tanaka, you decided to go back to the dorm. Is it Tanaka or Tanaka? I, I think it's Tanaka. Oh, we got a test today. The next chapter discusses the problems of the Kamakura Shogunate. Kamakura, I don't like this, man. Kamakura is so hard. Kamakura is cool and all, but it can't beat the Sengoku era. Have we covered enough of this yet? I could skip over to the Sengoku era. Yeah? All right, let's take a close look at the Sengoku era from the beginning. As you all know, it's generally agreed that a major factor leading up to the Sengoku War I I'm gonna start writing this down Onin Onin War 1467 Then Arrow Sengoku Goku After that, the next big event in the Sengoku era was the coup The coup of Meio uh, 1493 uh, Formation Formation uh, let's take a closer look at the Onin War in 1467. Oh, come on, man. I thought this was a test. Stay awake. Wow, is time up already? I can't believe that went by so fast. We're only up to 1467, but there's still a lot to cover. I guess it can't be helped. Next time, we'll jump to 1468. He stayed up and listened to the lecture. The academics has increased. Ah, uh, we need more academics. Oh. No one else is coming today. But they said we can't give you back your evoker. 
I wasn't expecting them to. That's why they started watching me in the first place. Oh, how's that cut doing? Probably already healed, huh? So, uh, how come you're not drawing today? Does it matter? Um... Well, uh, not really. Hey, they're all dried up. I guess it's been pretty hot lately. It's okay. I'll take care of it. What the... Oh, what was that? I made them healthy again. You can do that? She's not human, guys. I'm telling you this. She's probably like an angel or a devil. That's incredible, Chidori. Oh. It's nothing special. Nothing special? You have powers too, don't you? Hmm? Well, yeah, I guess. But that's about all I've got going for me. Without that, I'd be a nobody. I just talk a big game. Pretending like I'm some kind of hero. But in reality, I don't know what the hell I'm fighting for. Or why I'm here at all. Why? That is life's question, Junpei. Why we are here? When I was a kid, I had this crazy dream. What kind of dream? That one day I'd grow up to be a pro baseball player. Pretty stupid, huh? Nah, that's not stupid. That's pretty good, man. You could you could still achieve. I guess that's part of being a kid. Got good swing. Is that so? I don't remember much from my childhood. All I remember is being surrounded by white. Telling you guys she's sent from above. Huh? I hate hospitals. Yeah, me too. Don't do it, Junpei. <sighs> don't do it. I'm sorry. But I don't mind that much this time. Since you come to see me so often. Yeah, yeah, that's good. Sounds good. Chidori. I... I understand. <laughs> I won't let you down. Aww. Junpei's finally getting a girl, guys. Ah, oh, class is ended for today. Who are we meeting with? Actually, we could talk with Yuko. Oh, why am I facing a wall? All right. Yuko, where is she? Where are you, girl? Where are you, girl? I remember she was in the, uh, by the front, where people put on their shoes and stuff. She's not here? What? 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 Oh, no, wait, 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 wait. She's, uh, this way. To the other side she's camping like the the water fountain right she should be like right here oh there she is hey padkin i was wondering what i should do since there's no practice today uh narasimha that's one of my new personas uh would you like to spend time yeah man let's go let's have some fun you can seems happy i'm happy when you're happy You went to the ice strip mall. Oh, it is wakatsu. Fried mackerel was so good. Even though I eat lunch every day, I still get hungry after practice. I consider this an early dinner. I'll still eat dinner when I get home though. That's okay. I really have to stop eating between meals or I'll gain tons of weight once I'm not so busy with the team. Hey Padkin, do you think I eat too much? Nah, are you crazy? Not really, definitely. It doesn't matter to me. Not really. I agree, I just eat a little more than your average girl, right? I'm sure I burn off the extra calories during practice. As long as... Oh, okay, was that... That was just one point? You live in the dorm, right, Patkin? Not to pry, but... You must love being around good-looking girls like Yukari and Mitsuru. It's kind of nice, not necessarily. You're much cuter, Yuko. Uh... This is a hard choice, guys. This is a hard choice. This is a real life simulator right here. Hmm. Uh. I I'm gonna go with not necessarily. Oh no, you go, you, you go, girl. But nah, nah, it's good. 
Really? So not all guys like the same thing? Honestly, I wouldn't mind being more like them. Yay, she seems abused. Not that I'm desperate for attention or anything. Maybe I should go on a diet. I'm lazy, but it's the only way. I've decided I'm gonna stop eating between meals. Uh, my first goal is to tone up my arms. Did you hear that, Patkin? You're my witness. Yuko has told you about her resolution. Your relationship is stronger now. Yeah! No, I think as part of like a growing person, you should be able to eat healthy amounts, okay? You could eat... It, it all... It's all at the end of the day. If you eat like a lot the entire day, like the total day, then you've eaten a lot. But if you eat like moderate amounts, then it's fine. It's not like huge, 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 huge meals. Not like that. All right, here we go. <laughs> Level three, Strength Arcana. All right. Yuko seems to think of you as someone who's easy to talk to. However, you're still just casual acquaintances. Oh shoot, it's already this late. Let's stay a bit longer. Let's go. Stay a bit longer. Okay, I don't mind, but... Oh, she seems a little bit worried. On second thought, ah, let's go. I might be tempted to order something else. Aw. After saying goodbye to Yuko, he decided to go back to the dorm. I guess moved. That means new stuff. Shinjiro-san used his own money to purchase expensive dog food. Koromaru-san seems to really like it. I'm sorry, Koromaru. I... Maybe I could have bought him new food. I did not check. If you use Attack Fallen, we will attack any enemies that have been knocked down. If no enemies have been knocked down, then we will do our best to knock them down. During that time, however, we will be unable to heal and support, so be careful. Gary, checking your nails? Whenever I'm around Junpei, I sense a feeling of happiness. I wonder what happened to him. Well, he's happy himself, and happiness is contagious. Have you ever thought of what you're living for? No. I didn't before either, but I've been thinking about it a lot recently, especially when I look at her. She makes me think about what I'm living for. Uh, whether or not I fit into your battle plan is up to you. If I do, great. If I don't, whatever. I'm not going to change my style for you or anyone else. Okay, Shinjiro. That's okay with me. Koromaru, you wanna walk? No, he's eating. Yeah, he's eating. Oh, I failed him. I was supposed to be his real master. I failed him. We probably won't be going to the hospital. Okay, this guy, everyone's like lines changed except his. Should I go outside today? Well, I, think, I don't think I could buy dog food. This guy never sleeps. 24-7. Uh, Saturdays. Ooh, perfect. You know why? I have... Okay, super cat food. <gasps> I forgot to feed the cat again. Revival beat. I need to buy so many of this. Tanaka. Tanaka-san. Oh, it's you, Pat. Are you free at the moment? If so, I can teach you a valuable life lesson. Free of charge, of course. Really? Would you like to talk to President Tanaka tonight? Yeah, let's go talk to him. My, you're enthusiastic. He seems pleased. Nah, I, I seem like in the mood for my 40,000 yen back. Food. My schedule is so packed, I don't even have time to breathe. I don't usually deal with your average Joe, you know. You should be glad that you're such a handsome boy. Alright, let's add a new word to your vocabulary today. Repeat after me. Placebo. The stress is on the middle syllable. Placebo. Placebo. Splendid. It's so charming how you say it. Placebo. President Tanaka seems pleased. A placebo is a pretend pill. Basically, it's a medicine to ease your mind. Uh, eliminate those unsightly love handles without lifting a finger. It's a miracle breakthrough that will make you feel fabulous. Basically, it tricks your mind. That's it. A placebo tricks your mind. Enjoy a relaxing drive while taking in the beautiful scenery. Our incredible supplement will help you get the most out of life. These are part of our unique line of products. Is that legal? I don't think that's legal. Oh yes, of course. I'm free to sell them as I please. Ooh. 
Uh, we may not be providing tangible benefits, but we do provide peace of mind. People will pay handsomely for that, you know? Take emergency supplies, for example. People feel safe just because they have them. But do they work? But it's merely a false sense of security. That's it for today's lesson. You could pay me back when you make your first million. Uh, excuse me, I did make my first million. Like, I'm actually on my second round of making my first mi uh, second million. Not first million. You received somewhat questionable advice from Tanaka. You feel like you understand him a little bit better. All right, level two. Level two. Ooh, I don't like that one. That was a bit creepy. Yeah, it's a bit creepy. Go oh, level two. Shh. Level two. Travel Arcana. Have you been keeping your promise? You didn't tell anyone, did you? If you go back on your word, I'll upload your picture to an inter uh, internet dating site for former prison inmates. Oh my god, no! Nah, fam, no! President Tanaka left. Uh, Kaisuke, no? Sorry, uh, I'm busy. See you at school then. Kaisuke hung up. He sounded disappointed. I wanna like clear my Sundays, but there's so many people. There's uh, Akinari, there's Maya for Sundays. Mm, I really want to go on these Sunday dates with uh, other people, you know. Your academics has increased. You're stuck. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Blah, blah, blah. You're suffering from fatigue. No! Oh. Oh. Huh? Let me guess. Let me guess. Faros. Hi. It's been a while. It's been a while, Faros. Three seasons have passed since we met. Mm -hmm. Time goes by so quickly, and many things change. Yet some things will always remain the same. Don't you agree? What are we talking about? Everything changes. I don't know. Everything changes. Faris. If you say so, then perhaps I was mistaken. That's okay. I'm not condemning you that you're mistaken. Talking with you has stirred up certain memories. That tower, for instance. Which tower? I've been thinking about it lately. Oh, Tartarus? I wonder. Will our relationship stay the same? Or will it evolve? No matter what the future holds, you and I will be friends. Okay. That is for certain. The fact that this guy... His social link is deaf, man. This is so scary. Like, one of these days, I'm gonna be sleeping, and it's gonna be like... Eh! Eh! <laughs> Thou art I. Here we go. Death Arcade. Yeah, I think he's gonna finish me off one day, bro. Oh. Level 6. What? Level 6? Oh, because every time he meets me, I level up. Okay, okay. We were drawing so many cards today. <sighs> level 6. Death Arcana. Death and Devil Arcana. Oh, man. Wow. Wow. Uh, there's no school today. Starting tomorrow, I will feed the cat. Okay, we will we will change. We will actually change. Oh wait, wait, let's go. Let's go buy some stuff. Uh oh. <laughs> I love this song, man. It's so it's so cheesy. Hello, everyone. Welcome to Talaka's Amazing Commodities. Okay. Yup. Yup. Let's bring out our item of the day. Prayer beads. What? Guaranteed to make your friends jealous. Oh my goodness. I can't believe it's wonderfulness. Oh wait, there's more. We'll throw in one health supplement for only 10,000 yen. He only sells these things for like 10,000 yen. 10,000 yen, I give him 40k. Let's give him... 
Guys, it's only 10,000, man. Like, seriously? That's one, like, of those... Uh, card, uh, like, at the end of the fight, the cards. We got... Uh, oh, it doesn't say what they're... Okay, we got Justice, Moon, Priestess, Death, Death. Why do I have two Death? Lovers, Chariot, Priestess, Strike, Temperance, Fortune. Okay, guys. Th this guy, look how cool he looks. And his name is Dominion. I think the Justice Social Link has the sexiest characters. Like, they're called... Uh, What's it called? Power, Virtue, Dominion. Like, come on, man. That looks... They look cool, too. Uh, okay, no one speaks. It's, okay, no one speaks differently here. Oromaru always seems so happy. I'm a little jealous of him. He can be satisfied just eating a meal. I wish my life was that simple. Uh, yeah, simple is good. <laughs> okay, uh... Uh, Shinji's a really good cook. I can't say from experience, though. I've never had anything he's made. How are you getting along with Shinjiro? He's a little rough around the edges, but deep down, he's a nice guy. Just give him a chance. Uh, I'm not gonna leave the dorm, because if I come back, it's already evening. Okay, I wanna do Hermit, guys. Oh, I really wanna complete Maya, and then spend all our time in a row with just Akinari. That's his name, right? Akinari? Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure it's... Maya wants to play with you. We are gonna play. Whoa, did you just get here? We signed on at the same time. The weather's nice today, huh? Let's go outside. In game, duh. Taisto! Uh, oh, what was that and sign? Is that a bag? Conan District. A uh, gray colored sky stretches as far as the eye can see. A barren wasteland lies before Tatsuya and Maya. Maya is stretching. The air is nice even though the world has ended. Psh, yeah, right. It's just a game. We should go level or something. I'm so lazy in real life, Tatsu. I haven't even gotten dressed up or put on makeup. Uh, Maya stands at attention. I'm so pissed off right now. Mr. E is such a stupid... S.O.B. Uh, are you drunk again? Who's Mr. E? Tatsuya, you know too much. I shouldn't have mentioned his name, huh? Ha 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 R-O-F-L uh, M-A-O uh, Don't get me busted, okay? She's having fun. She's looking around. Uh, there aren't many that many players anymore. Most of them left for that new MMO, C O W Cow. Oh, you mean like World of Warcraft? Like maybe back then when this game was made, World of Warcraft was hot. It's still hot, but not as back then. There were a lot of dupers and gold farmers, but still, it's good though, cause it lets us talk about personal things, right? Maya is a shy girl, you know. See, Mr. E is a teacher with seniority over me. Who knows? You can't figure out what my job is, can you? Joking master. And she's a reporter. Uh, teacher. Uh, I would say teacher. Yeah, you're smart. I knew you'd figure it out. You get an A plus for reading comprehension today. Yeah. Uh, oh, it's a fi thumbs up. I thought she's like a D minus. Uh, Maya seems happy. Now you know I'm a teacher. Hey, I just figured something out. When I complain to you, I feel better afterwards. From now on, we have to group together. Uh, promise, okay? Uh, she's comfortable telling... Oh, telling you about her real life. Oh my god. Relationship is stronger now. I thought we're not supposed to talk about real life in the uh, online... Uh, mysterious voice. Ooh. Forgotten how the hermit looks like. Oh yeah. Uh, look look at this man's room. It, it's so nice. Here we go. Level 5 Hermit Arcana. His room is so nice and simple. I'm so pumped. I think I'll clean uh, the, the bathroom. It's been two months. Ooh. Oh my god. 
My is signed back on. Don't mention that SOB stuff, okay? It's our little secret. My is player signed off. Decided to log off as well. What is your class gonna do for the culture culture festival? Oh, what? Culture festival in this game? Haunted house. I bet I'll be stuck playing ghost. Being a ghost isn't so bad. You're gonna show up and put on the costume. I have to do a magic show. By the way, did you hear a typhoon is on its way? Here, it's a big one. This school will be empty. First bell is rung. Ooh, we'll be talking about nuclear fission today. Oh, man. Oh, I'm bad at physics. Imagine a nuclear reaction in which a massive nucleus splits into smaller nuclei, uh, releasing energy as it does. I believe you all know that much. The reaction emits massive quantities of energy, which is why it's used in nuclear power plants. You all know that Japan has three nuclear pro prohibitions in place, right? Let's see, Pat. Ooh, man, I don't know. Which of these is not one of Japan's prohibitions on nuclear weapons? Oh, they can't produce. But I'm, I'm, I'm sure Japan does not have... Uh, oh, man. They can't produce. Japan does not have nuclear weapons, I think. Can't let others produce. Uh, this one can't allow into Japan. So, I'm pretty sure it's this one. Woo! Correct. We forbid possession, production, and admission of nuclear weapons within Japan. Yeah, because you, I don't think Japan can control other nations. Uh, the third prohibition is a little controversial, but this is physics class, not political science. Now it's for nuclear fission. Woohoo, guys, we got it. Yeah. I'm still gonna get, I'm still gonna try to get right answers, even though we have max charm. Because I love these questions. Oh, hey, are you coming to the student council meeting today? I have an announcement to make about the smoking incident. Uh, I'm not sure. I see. Well, I'd like you to come, but I won't force you. Excuse me. Hey guys, today we are going with... We are going with... Is it is class over? Alright. Everyone seems excited about the upcoming festival. I have not experienced such an event before. Same. I've never experienced it before. She's still far... Okay, yeah. She's still far from experiencing human... Uh, qu uh, qualities. Oh, Pat Kin, are you heading home? Yes, we are, I think. Parvati. I haven't used her yet, but, uh... Alright, we're going to the rooftop again. Ekon High School. Rooftop. Oh, wait. Oh, we're, we're still doing the lunch thing? Uh, hopefully she made it better now. Would you mind trying some of it? I think it'll taste better than last time. At least, it can't be worse. Any worse. This food looks better than the food she prepared last time. Hey, it doesn't mean it's edible. Oh. Meow. It's a cat. A kitty cat. He's so cute. He looks hungry, doesn't he? Here, kitty, kitty. Oh, oh. Maybe I should give him some food. What do you think, Pat Kun? Oh. Oh. Sure. Guys. I did it for Fuka, but the cat doesn't like it. The cat ran away. What happened? Wait, was it the food? Oh gosh. Oh, this tastes horrible. I must have left it out for too long. That spoiled Fuka. No. Sorry, Patkin. Please don't eat any of this. I don't want you to get sick. Oh. I didn't mean. I didn't mean for this to happen. I'm so disappointed. I just want to help everyone, even outside of battle. And there aren't many chances to eat homemade food when you live in the dorm. So I thought it would be nice to make lunch for everyone, but I need to get better at cooking. Maybe with your help, I can, uh, Patkin, I can. Uh, yay! Relationship has grown strong. So <laughs> I wonder if like the social link is just cooking. Maybe at the end, she'll cook like a very luxurious meal.
Guys, we leveled up so many social links this episode. Oh my gosh. Woo! Here we go! Level 2! Level 2. Bridge this arcana. Fuka thinks you're easy to talk to. She considers you as a friend. Yay! It's kind of hard for me to say this after all that's happened, but... I'd be happy if you'd be willing to taste test my food again. Well, I'll see you later. So basically, she's saying uh, she'll be, she's happy she'll be happy if we are willing to take one for the team. Harabaru? Ooh, yo! I heard there's a typhoon heading this way, dude. I hope it doesn't just pass by, because if it did, we wouldn't get the day off. So we'd have to walk in this. Oh, that sucks. Nah, that's crazy, man. That's crazy. So we have to go to school even if there's a typhoon. And that would totally suck. I mean, uh, like if it passes by and it's like raining. Oh yeah, he's here today. We've defeated nine shadows, which means only three remain. That's fantastic. We are so close to the end. Please keep up the good work. Can we go for a walk? No, Korobaru. Why have you betrayed me? Uh, so, a big ass shadow appears during the full moon. And you've already beat nine of them? Not bad. Yeah. Okay, guys, I'm gonna save. I'll beat you in Polonia Mall. Okay, looks like Tanaka is not here. Uh, so, I don't know what to do. Tanaka-san is not here. Mondays is not here. So, please. Oh, wow. I forgot to feed the cat. Oh, man. No. <laughs> bad start, guys. We had a bad start. Uh, I don't know what to do. I... That's got to make me smarter, right? Nope. 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 I think that was uh, courage or charm. Hey, Pat. Three left, huh? And the next one won't come for another three weeks. Man, why can't they just come all at once? Uh, that would be tough. Uh, that's true. But with more people now, it should be easier to defeat them. I can't wait for the next full moon. But we only have one leader. We can't split the team, man. It's too much. Oh, it's uh, Dr. Junior. Uh, are you coming to club today? I haven't decided yet. That's right. You're free to make your own decisions. Oh, sorry. I didn't mean to say that out loud. Everyone's free to make their own decisions. Well, I'll see you later. Uh, he's... Oh... Ooh, decisions, huh? Maybe you should go to the art club. Um, no, I'm sorry. I'm hanging out with Chihiro. But first, the cat. I remembered. Cat. Okay. See, the good thing is they allow us to... To leave school. But we could come back. Oh, no. If you come back and feed it some more, it might get healthier. Tomorrow, again, again. We gotta keep feeding this cat. We must not forsake the cat. Oh, Pat-san, are you on your way home? Would you like some company? Sure. Uh, Dominion, one of those badass dudes. Uh, would you like to spend some time? Sure. Uh, let's go somewhere for a while. Sure. Sweet job. You and Chihiro had a really good time together. What should I do? Uh, is something wrong? No, nothing's wrong. Why does it seem like something's wrong? Uh, is there a red bean jam on my face? No. Remember when you saved me from that creep, Pat-san? From that day on... Uh, oh! The doctor said, oh, my health hasn't been so great. The doctor said I'm fine, but... Uh, I guess I'll tell you, Pat-san, since you've been so nice to me. But don't think I'm weird, okay? Last night, uh, I, uh... You see, I had this... Uh, I have dreams about you every single night, Pat-san. Oh, man! Oh, man! Oh, man! Chihiro's got the hots for us. Um... Uh, it's just a coincidence. It's just your imagination. Oh. Ooh. It's just a coincidence. 
I, I thought it was probably just a coincidence too, but <laughs> she seems giddy. Uh, I dream about you every night. This has never happened to me before. I appreciate how nice you've been to me, Pansan. But one of these days, I might want to be more than just your friend. Oh! <laughs> he says that Chihiro cares for you. Uh, oh, it seems like things are starting to get serious. Oh! 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 Oh, guys. It's getting heated. <sighs> All right. All right. The treasurer, level five. Okay. Here we go. <laughs> Woo! I disconnected my. Oh my god. Oh shit. Oh shit. Level five, Justice Arcana. Woo! That one was crazy. Uh, she might get upset if you go out with another girl. Oh, really? Oh, sorry. I've just been babbling like an idiot. I get so nervous when I'm around you, Patsan. Especially when you look at me that way. Sorry. Uh, don't apologize. Don't be hard on yourself. I'm always talking about my problems, Patsan. You're just too nice. Chihiro seems happy. I think I'm starting to overcome my fear of men. So far, I can only talk to boys uh, I know, but I can almost look them in the eye. With your help, Patsan, I feel like I can do even better. Chihiro closed her eyes. As long as there's nothing scary, I'll be fine. Like spiders? If you make the wrong move, you might upset her. What will you do? Oh my god. Oh my god. Um... Woo. Guys, l l l uh, gather around, gather around. Uh, to be honest, I wasn't aiming for Chihiro. Uh, so how will I? How, how, how can I settle this, guys? I need your help. Uh, I, I saved before I went out, so I'm, I'm kind of asking for your ideas, guys. Um, but we're gonna do this again with Chihiro. But I need. Your help. Should I? What? 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 What should I choose? So I'm gonna end the, the episode here, guys, and uh, we'll come back to this conversation in the next episode. I'll keep in mind what you guys say. Thank you guys for watching. I uh, hope you like this one. So I'll see you guys in the next episode. Remember, divided we are unequal, but together we are kings and queens. I'll see you next time.